Welcome back to Dark Messiah of Might and Magic. So I just explored over here, found the secret lurking up there, so let's go this way. Also, it sounds like a dying whale is calling for my attention. I'm coming, I'll save you. Whale of the desert. It's magnificent. Except that it's dead. Bring it back to life and we can be on our way. Wait, what's magnificent? And what's dead? What are you even talking about? Is he looking at- is he like squinting at the thing on the complete opposite side of the room that I can barely see? This thing? Let's do it. Strange, you're going to meet his dragon. What are you doing? Let me put me down, you son of a bitch. Thank God that didn't hurt, because it looks like he just cut me in half. I should probably take some health potions here. Stranger, well done. I just realized I've got like. Like 12 health potions left, oh my god. I am not dying anytime soon. Oh, here we go. He said I can walk free. Will they obey his word? Are they honorable? Wonderful. Now, let's do what we came here to do. Uh-huh. That spider artifact looks like a key. Let's see where we can use it. it. No! Aratok say fair fight! Hate, stranger! Better not see stranger again. Aratok dead! Bad for tribe! Stranger better run! Go! Good. Ox fight you again! Ox kill you! Fair enough. After that long fight, my shield has got to be beat to crap. I should probably replace it, but let me check it first. <laughs> yeah, 300, 240. It was just about to fall off me. Alright, skill points. Um, should I spend them or wait? 
Um, mm, I'm gonna wait for level, yeah, level three strength. Because I get a huge boost in damage from plus three to plus six. Also, that'll mean I can use this soul drinker. Yeah, let's save him. You know, Sarath, if everything else goes well, you'll be seeing your father soon. Here? What do you mean? It's hard to explain, but I'm sure he'll be here to see his fine young son claim the Skull of Shadows. That sounds... weird. Is he some sort of wizard? <laughs> dialogue. <laughs> I suppose you could say that. Though I'm not sure he'd like to be spoken of that way. My father. I've never met him. Why is he so important? He's a very powerful, very potent person. Like any powerful person, he has powerful enemies. Meaning what? Who? Well, the seventh dragon, for one. This dialogue is just amazing. It's like, that's weird. <laughs> this long-lost father who sounds like he's a demon or something. Oh, they even shoved a long-lost father plot into there. So there's skulls of shadows, there's... Spider keys, damsels in distress, demon succubus woman. Long lost father, which I think I've already mentioned, but I guess I'll mention it ten more times. This story is amazing. Yo! Sarath! You did it! The temple is overflowing with energy! I feel like I can lift a mountain! Try lifting a door instead. Let's get the skull and get away from here before Arantir... Before Arantir sticks what's left of his nose in here. You go first. To make sure that it's safe. <laughs> oh my god. She feels like she can lift a mountain, but she still feels like I should go first, huh? Okay. Uh... Are, are you gonna... Oh. Oh. Hi. I chased you on the rooftop before. You're not the same one, are you? Probably not. Is that another one I hear? Yes. Come here. Come to me on the stairs. Whoa, don't go down there. Hello? What are you doing back there? Silly. Okay, what, what am I actually supposed to be doing? Oh, that's it? Oh, okay. It's jammed! I'll need to add more energy to open it. Jump through when it's wide enough. I'll be right behind you. I have oh, surprise! Leanna! It's a pity you got in the way. Okay, I'll run. Bye. You have oh. last that you should have. Mm -hmm. Oh, she said I'm run. so sorry for you, my dear. But there's nothing... She said run. I'm not gonna stay for the plot exposition. The spider statue. We must get closer. There's sure to be an inscription. Something. Ooh, I think I'm gonna be facing undead down here. Getting that feeling. Look! The spider statue! We need to get closer to see how it works. I feel like that might not be a statue. I think I'm gonna have to fight one of them. Hello. Come on. Uh. 
You gone don't piss me off. <laughs> he cut off his head when he was still in the ground. Uh, his body's physics didn't like that. I wonder if there's anything up there. up there, but it's not that important. Oh, it came down. Huh. Alright, I'm getting out of here. I'm supposed to go up here. Note to self, don't get on rope when I've just put it out. It totally messes up. I can't even move. There we go. Oh, wait, no. There we go. What? That was not far enough to kill me. Come on. Got brittle bone syndrome. The spider statue. We must get closer. There's sure to be an inscription. Something. All right. Blah blah blah. I don't really need to kill you. I guess I'll do this for the fun of it. Goodbye. door. Yeah, I feel like this thing's gonna come to life. See the plaque? The four sockets are for four gems. Urgash knows where the vermin in these tombs might have hidden them. <laughs> Collect the gems to unlock the doors. Oh, everything about this game is just like generic fantasy. Right, hold on, just in case I encounter a boss, I want my potions. I want to be able to use them really quickly. Unfortunately, the game doesn't pause when you open up the menu. Um, I guess it's fine. I can probably run away and use like a stone skin potion or something, because I've got so many of these things and I've barely used them. Yeah, it'll be fine. It'll be fine. All right, it's so here, beyond that door. Ah, oh, can you sense it? Oh God, I think she really likes it. So that's what I'm supposed to unlock, so I need to go everywhere else to find the gems. Uh, I don't suppose this opens? Hmm. Now we need to figure out how to open that door. Wait, is this a thing opened by putting the gems into this, or is it that thing? Or is it both? I don't know. I mean, where the hell am I supposed to go? One's lit, one isn't. Does that mean something? I don't think stabbing is going to work. But I don't know. Oh, wait. To enter the crypt, place the moon silk, moon silk crystal in the spider's head. To enter the shrine of the Skull of Shadows, return the three aspect gems. Oh, okay.
With a fallen prophet's bones in the walls of the crypt. Do I hear something nasty? What what am I hearing? Oh, it's just the pissed off zombies down below. So it looks like I only need the Moonsilk Crystal to open the entrance to the crypt. So does that mean I need the Moonsilk Crystal first, and then I can get these other things to open up the main thing? The Skull of Shadows? I'm not entirely sure where I'm supposed to be looking for this stuff. Because I don't think that's here, right? I think I need to open up the crypt or whatever and then go find them. I guess I just go back down. Kill all the zumbles. Hiya! Oh, whoops. Hiya! How did I get poisoned? What the? Oh, hello. Oh. Ow. Oh, there it is. Alright, we're good. Yeah, so this is what I use to get to the main place, and then I get all the little sub-gems from the crypt, and then that's what I need. So this, what, goes here? Goes here. Goes here. Goes nowhere. Place it in the head. Oh, there we go. Oh, that does actually hurt me. I was wondering if the beam would hurt me, and it does. Ooh, eight skill points. That means... Oh, I need ten for the next level of strength. Damn. Come on, speed it up. There's a whole upper level, probably full of secrets. It's funny, some parts of this game actually remind me of Thief. I think it's just because there's quite a few secrets, and uh, probably the rope bow. I think it's the rope bow that really reminds me of Thief. God, that was such an amazing bow in Thief. It increased the ability for you to just traverse and go exactly where you want, uh, especially vertically, to, to such an amazing degree. Looks like that can probably be broken open. Breaking open tombs also reminds me of Arx Fatalis. Coincidentally made by the same people that made this game. Arcane Studios. <laughs> you can't you can't kick things while you're crouched. I suppose that makes some sort of sense. Be a little bit difficult. Can I make it? I don't even have to. Let's do this. Oh god! Oh come on! The fall height is ridiculously unforgiving in this game. What the? Oh, right. That almost killed me. Cool. Sounds like I'm raising the dead.
<laughs> magic mushroom. Why is there a magic mushroom in, like, a, a crypt? A crypt cubby or whatever you call these things. Alright, um, so I actually need to be really, really watchful for stuff because I need to find the gems. That is what I'm here for. Under the tomb of he who waged the wars of blood, in the walls of the crypt, and with a fallen prophet. Okay, I'm just about to die. Please don't hit me. I probably shouldn't even kill these things. I don't I don't think it's worth it. Let's reevaluate my life on this chain. I suppose I could stab at their heads from oh, okay. Calm down. I suppose I could stab at their heads from up here. Nah, they got bored of me. <laughs> More magic mushrooms. Let me see how much they heal, actually. I'm curious. I've got a bunch of them. Oh, whoa. Okay. Uh, it doesn't say restores your health fully, but it just went from, like, below 10 to 70, so that is essentially a full health potion. Okay, that is that is really, really good. Let's put those in my health bar. Ooh, can I hit him? Damn it! Oh, I could kick them down into the abyss. That'd be pretty cool. I think I could probably crawl through there. I don't know if I'd want to, though. Oh, wait, I can just break it. Bingo! Oh, yeah. Can I snipe you? Only 200 more arrows till I kill it. <laughs> really? Alright, I'll take it. <laughs> well, if I was extremely patient, I could just do that for all of them, but I am not that patient. Oh god. Yeah, movement in this game is pretty clunky. Alright, I need to get down. fuck is that happening? Am I, like, stepping in a puddle of goo? <clears throat> Whatever, I'm not using an antidote. Screw that. <clears throat> I probably should have used an antidote. Too late now, though. Oh, whoa, that looks like a trappy thing. Yeah, that's like something that's gonna shoot a fireball out of its muzzle. Oh, it's a loading screen. To where? Whoa. This looks elaborate. Yeah, those are definitely trappy things. I feel like that's gonna close behind me and this is gonna be some sort of a boss arena. From the gem. Go back. No, we're oh. moving away from the gem. 
Alright, she really wants me to stay here. Hmm, it's a spike thing. Oh, that's what it is. They can throw up. This actually might be effective. Of course, that's a hell of a lot more effective. The maiden's eye, an artifact of fate and doom. It's nearby, somewhere above us. If I can just get them to the spikes, but getting them there is a little bit dangerous, especially in such low health. Let's use a magic mushroom. It's probably not worth it to attack them, actually. I, they probably are just infinite, or damn near infinite. Alright, that breaks that thing. That goes... I don't even know where that goes. Let's find out. Oh, cool. I got one. Not quite long enough. Guess I gotta go down the stairs. Well, this should be fun, actually. Kick him. No, we're moving away from the gem. Go back. Wait, the gem's up there. No, we're moving away from the gem. Go back. Great. That did almost nothing. Oh, for fuck's sake. Ow. Alright, where's the gem? What do you want me to do? Is that the gem? Okay, how do I get it? Get out of here. Get out of here. Get out of here. Get out of here. <clears throat> I remember being extremely annoyed with this section when I played it years and years ago. And indeed it is annoying. I don't think there's any point in killing him. Um, I think I just put probably a rope arrow up there and probably just go grab it physically. Oh, come on. There we go. You like it? Alright, you happy? Xanax or whatever your name is? Okay, now I need to get off this thing without killing myself. Uh... Okay, there we go. Goodbye! Alright, so we're good with that. Yeah, now I need to return the Maiden's Eye, but I don't think there's any point in doing that until I have all of the others as well. Because I think you need all of them at the same time. Get down there. Alright, I think I got most of them. Let's go see what's down here. <laughs> All 
Did you just throw up on me? God damn it. Oh god, when was my last save from? Oh, okay, that's fine. Whatever. There's another one. Where did it go? Ooh, nice dodge. There's a secret up there. Looks like I have to go that way. <laughs> oh, okay. Mm hmm. Maybe this is one of the tombs of the emperors or whatever. It's probably rigged with explosives. What did I just do? Is that a good thing or a bad thing? Okay, did some sort of a weight thing. Cool. Pretty sure that thing is gonna explode if I take this, but whatever, I'm gonna take it. Strange. It makes me feel uneasy. It's unpleasant to lift it. Those are evil, dangerous weapons, Sarath. Weapons of the Dragon Knights. They were holy fanatics, in league with the Seventh Dragon when he tried to murder your father. Holy fanatics? If they're trying to murder my father, does that mean my father was a demon? And I'm demon spawn? Let's see, where did it go? There it is. Oh, damage plus nine. Plus 18 against undead creatures. That sounds amazing. Oh, if only I had one more skill point, I could actually have enough strength to use it. Yeah, that is that is incredible. That is most likely going to be my next weapon. Man, I've got so much crap on me. Look at all this nonsense. Alright, dump that thing. Put this one on. It's doing a bit better. Longsword, don't need it. I don't think I need two endless quivers. Let's dump all the stuff I can't use and will never be able to use. Stealth 2, nah. Archery 2, nah. Critical hit 1, maybe, but that's not a very good sword in general, so nah. I'll keep this Miss Hammer. It was a terrible weapon, Staff of the Fire Lord. It's cool looking, but eh. Gonna bunch everything together so I can actually see new stuff when it pops up. Okay. I don't know why I right justified everything. I should have left justified it, but I'm not gonna change that. Alright, so this is a time limited thing. So I think I need to do this and then run up. Uh, I don't know what actually opens, but I am gonna have to run up. So let's save it, and let's go. Can't go up that way. Wait, does it open this? I don't... I don't think this was open before. Is that what this is? I, I don't remember this. Ah, yep. Looks like I might be able to reopen it. <laughs> I can. Okay, it's not that big of a deal. A bit slow to open, but I can open it. Didn't mean to do that. Ah! 
I am not gonna fight them. There's way too many. A safe point that I can run up to if I need to. Need to get some uh, time to think. How close are they? Wait, what did I just pick up? Ring of Arcane Brilliance? Get out of here! Oh, they're coming out of the water. It's time to skadoodle. King Darius Papyrus, leader of the main sword armies during the wars of blah blah blah. blah. I don't know if I can do a finishing move when they're in the water, they kinda of float. Anyway, open up. I don't think he's gonna be too happy that I opened him. Ew, dusty. Smells like old. Oh, I can actually travel down there. <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> Thing was too buoyant for him. Anything else in here? And what is with the lighting? He keeps like getting super Oh, super bright and super dark. Alright, I'm out. See ya. It is not worth trying to attack them. It really is not. Hey, buddy. What you doing sleeping on the job? <clears throat> Rude awakening. Careful for secrets. There's a lot of places where secrets could be, and I don't want to miss an awesome weapon. Although I think I already found the awesome weapon that I'm going to be using. In the form of the uh, Soul of the Dragon Glob, but still. Might be something even cooler. Close behind me, isn't it? I have a bad feeling about this. Me too. Yep. Yep. You ain't dead, are you? Or you're undead. I'm gonna get really, really far away. And I'm gonna shove my face full of food. Mm -hmm. I sense a defiler, a living worm that can't dispense its filth and warmth. It's a lich!
I could probably cheese this fight just by shooting rope arrows into its face the entire time. That would be awfully boring, though. Alright. Let's go for it. I'm gonna save it. I'm gonna try a stone skin potion. I've never used it before. It does slow me down. But it should mean that I can take crap tons of damage. I can still see you! How's it? Alright, cool fight. Give me your gem. Another staff of the Fire Lord. Looks like that's my exit, too. Now that I have enough skill points for this, I can do a crap ton more damage just on its own. And I can now use these two swords. There's a Soul Drinker and the Sword of the Dragon Claw. Sword of the Dragon Claw does way more damage. This one does restore my health, though. Let's see what both do. Or, let's see what both look like. See if they have different movesets or something like that. Try the Soul Drinker first. Ooh, pretty. Now, is that a short sword, basically? Mm, no, it seems to be about the same length as a uh, cleaver. Yeah, same attack pattern as all the normal swords. What about the Sword of the Dragon Claw? Ooh, ah, it what burns. The? It's accursed, I tell you. It's woven with spells for the death of our kind. Oh, so I am a demon. I can't. I can't use the holy weapon. I'm gonna have to remember this. I should try it again later. It looks powerful. You already have other powers. Forget this. No thanks. I think I'll use it when you're free of me. Or something. I'm guessing that's gonna be when I'm able to use it. So do I want the Soul Drinker over the Cleaver? It does do significantly less damage. I don't know. I mean, it might allow me- it might restore so much health that I can just tank the damage and just like, flail away like an idiot. I want to try it. Let's try it. That did not restore any health. Nor did that. That was weird. This is the life drinker, right? As 30% of damage dealt to wielder's health. Didn't look like it actually restored any health. I think I got a little bit of passive healing from my ring regeneration, but I think that was it. There. I can sense another gem. The matron's heart. Quickly. It represents life and birth. <laughs> what do you mean quickly? Hasn't this been here for like 2,000 years? It ain't going anywhere. Calm down. Surprisingly effective method of combat. Ring around the rosy. Poke you full of hoses. Or hoses. <laughs> Once again, that did nothing. Yeah, this weapon's actually not bad. It doesn't quite restore enough health for me to just tank it like a jackass, but it certainly does uh, take off the edge of combat. 
this place is massive. Look at all those places I can put arrows into. Ooh. I want to go swinging around like a monkey. Aw, oh, what? Someone greased the poles. The arrows won't go in. Things make weird noises. Boadon, first seer. Oh yeah, which one am I supposed to look at? The matron's heart with a fallen prophet. Uh, I don't know who a prophet is. Well, I can't open it, so I suppose it's not that one. Oh, Prophet of Fate. I guess that's it. And, of course, it's missing. Where did it go, by chance? Don't worry, Sarath. You can jump. As long as you hit the water. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Oh, fuck! This entire game is like constantly walking around on Vaseline. Oh god, am I all the way back here? There. I can sense another gem. The matron's heart. Quickly. Represents life and birth. Alright, I'm gonna be fast. I'm not even gonna kill the things. Although I might have to, actually. We'll see. Get off. Get off. I want this thing. Oh my god, what the hell is that? It's a little dull. Yeah, this thing is creepy as hell. Yeah, this is this is really disturbing. A tiny little doll, it's like imprisoned, chained down. Can I do anything with it? Don't worry, Sarath. You can jump as long as you hit the water. Might be some secrets over there that I'm missing. Eh, oh well. Oh. Ow. Alright, that's it. <laughs> Got them all. I was expecting that to be harder. Ooh, shortcut. This isn't the way I'm supposed to go, is it? Because these are still closed. This was the shortcut I opened up, which implies that I'm supposed to go back here. Oh shit, it closed behind me. 
Well, wait, then I feel like I should go back the way I just went. Unless I'm supposed to go up here? Is there a way out up here? Oh yeah, I just need to get across, don't I? Oh god. Well. How's she doing? Maybe this could be even better if it reaches all the way down, although I don't think it will. Mm, oh yeah, it does. Sweet. I wonder what that says. Oh, wait a minute. I think there's some armor down there. Brennadane, Arch Revelator. Mattius, Oracle of the Third Doom. Chainmail. That's, that's crap. That's really old armor. Get out of here. Okay, there we go. Oh yeah, here I've been. Alright, I'm ready to come out of the hole now. Okay. Got all the gems and... Sorry to leave you on a cliffhanger, but I think this is a pretty good place to end the episode. So, I hope you enjoy so far, and I'll be back soon.